Dear students, I am Sova Bansiwal, Assistant Professor English, SPC Government College Bhim. Today I am going to explain the second act of the play um, A Doll's House by Henrik Ibsen. Uh, it, it is uh, in the course of BA second year um, paper first of English literature. Uh, in this second act, we see that Nora is going to present a dance in a fancy dress party uh, in um, in Craig St uh, in Stainbox uh, home upstairs on Christmas Eve. Nora uh, Nora Nora's friend uh, Mrs. Linde comes to their home and. Uh, um, Nora tells Mrs. Linde that uh, she forced the signature of her father uh, to get money uh, for the treatment of her husband, uh, Torvald Helmer. Uh, see, uh, Nora also tells Mrs. Linde that Dr. Rank is suffering from uh, tuberculosis of his spine. Um, because of her, because of his father's uh, moral lapses, and uh, he is, um, and he has said to her that when he will know about um, upcoming about his upcoming death, he will um, inform Nora by sending a visiting card on which uh, there will be a black cross. Uh, here, uh, Krog Estate, um, Niels Krog Estate, uh, comes to meet Nora, and he uh, he tells Nora that uh, she has to ask her husband to uh, not to uh, shake him from his job. Um, Otherwise, uh, there will be bad consequences for her because uh, he has the documents on which uh, Nora has um, forged the signature of her father. Uh, so he, um, so he um, tries to um, manipulate her to. Um, save her uh, to save his job Nora uh, Nora appeals to her husband Torvald Helmer not to shake um, Neil Scrog estate but um, um, Torvald Helmer becomes very angry uh, he um, he speaks ill of Neil Scrog estate before um, Nora. He says that Neil Scrog estate is a bad influence on his uh, family and children, and he says that uh, he will replace um, um, Mrs. Linde at the place of. Uh, Neil Krog estate. He says that uh, he doesn't like Neil Krog estate also because uh, Neil Krog estate uh, is his friend uh, since his um, boyhood days and that's why he um, behaves with famili familiarity um, in his office. It means he behaves very familiarly to um, Torvald Helmer in his office and uh, Torvald doesn't like this um, so he want to uh, sack him from the job and uh, he want to replace him with Mrs. Linde uh,
Torvald Helmer uh, Nora uh, Nora receives uh, Neil's Krog estate um, comes with a letter and he drops a letter uh, for Torvald Helmer in his uh, letter box. Uh, in this letter he has written all about the forgery of uh, Nora. Um, when uh, Mrs. when Nora comes to know about this, uh, she appeals uh, to Mrs. Lindy to uh, tell uh, Neil's Krog estate uh, to take his letter back. But um, as uh, Mrs. Lindy is a uh, is a familiar of uh, Miss as Mrs. Linde uh, knows Neil's Krog estate uh, as um, both of them wanted to marry in their young could in their young age uh, but they couldn't uh, because uh, Mrs. Lin uh, because uh, uh, Mrs. Linde married uh, some another man uh, for his money. Uh, so, so later they both of them became uh, widow. Uh, means uh, Mrs. Linde became widow and uh, uh, Toru and uh, Niels Krog estate became a widower. So uh, they uh, they they knew um, each other. So, uh, Mrs. Lindy um, goes to Neil's Krog estate's home to uh, request him to take back his letter. But when she reaches there, she comes to know that uh, Neil's Krog estate is not in the city. He is out of the city. Um, so, um, she comes back and Nora is very terrified. She feels that uh, if he, if um, um, she feels that if uh, Neil's Krog estate comes to know about this, uh, he will take all the responsibility of her forgery, and he will make sacrifice. Uh, she has this um, illusion, uh, which is uh, which breaks. Uh, at later stage in this act. Um, later, uh, Mrs. Linde uh, and uh, and uh, Mrs. Linde and Niels Krog estate meet and Niels Krog estate um, both of them propose um, to live e with each other um, as they both both of them were alone. Uh, so they um, so they uh, they uh, decide to marry and uh, uh, Neil Krog estate uh, agrees to forgive all uh, forget all uh, all Neil Krog estate uh, forgets decides to forget everything about the matter of forgery and uh, he agrees to take back the uh, letter from the letter box of Torvald Helmer but uh, um, but um, uh, Mrs. Linde uh, asks him to not to take back the letter because uh, she does so not with some evil intention, but with um, with friend, uh, for, but for the fa benefit of her friend um, Nora. She says that um, it will be better if all the situation bef between them become clear, uh, so that Nora uh, need not to live in um, some secrecy. But uh, when Torvald Helmer takes this uh, letter from the letter box and see, he reads, he becomes very furious and uh, 
before this uh, uh, Nora tries to uh, stop uh, Torvald Helmer to read this letter and for this is she exercises the dance Tarantella uh, which has uh, wild accents and uh, this these uh, dance um, presents the inner conflict uh, the inner agitation of Nora uh, but later when uh, Torvald Helmer reads the letter he becomes very furious he abuse he speaks ill to, to um, Nora he says that uh, just as Dr. Rank suffers um, tuberculosis due to the lapses of his uh, father, in the same way, uh, Nora herself is suffering from these lap uh, the lapses of his father uh, because uh, he thought uh, because he thinks that his fa her father, Nora's father, uh, lacks some scruples. And that is why his daughter Nora is also suffering from uh, moral lapses. Um, all these remarks uh, gives uh, a lot of pain and hurt to Nora. Uh, but uh, there is another letter in which um, uh, to Niels Krogestad uh, writes that he he. He agrees to forget uh, all the matter and he wants to wash his hands of this matter. Uh, so, um, uh, Krogis, uh, so Torval Helmer uh, becomes uh, kind again and he uh, tries to soothe uh, Nora. But Nora has decided something. She feels that all, all of her married life, uh, her husband, uh, Torvald, has, um, has treated her like a doll. Um, so, uh, in this... Um, In this um, act, uh, we see uh, that there is another letter also, uh, visiting card also, in which uh, there is a black cross, uh, black cross, which uh, signifies, uh, which is symbolic of um, Dr. Rang's uh, death. Dr. Rang's. Uh, Symbolic of um, Dr. Rank's uh, death in coming in in a few days. So uh, this this act uh, ends uh, with this situation. In this. Uh, in this, in this act, the dance Tarantella signifies the uh, inner feelings of uh, Nora. She knows that uh, after this dance, she will not be able to live uh, more than 31 hours. Thank you.